it going, everyone? I'm the Star Grenade, and welcome back to more than a Nostalgia Train. <laughs> All right. Now that we're at the boss, who do we got? Uh. Oh. Goma? Really? Yeah, actually, I think I remember how to beat Goma. Your best bet, honestly, is to <laughs> stay as far away as possible. How did that not count? There we go. Ah! Jeez! Okay. Next up, now that that's done, we have to throw pellets at its face and avoid getting hit by it. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Well, hi, what are you? What are you? something It's tr I feel like it's trying to be nice but jeez I feel like it's trying to be nice It's actually benefiting me not to move, so... Dang! I was wondering... Oh my gosh. Because he have one more hit. He was being very spastic about that. <sighs> you got a heart container. Woohoo! Alright. Well, that was actually pretty easy. Alright, next up. This room. What's in here? Uh... <laughs> I want to burn the element. wanted some acid rain. I don't know. An essence of nature. Bathed in drops of something that my hat is in the way of. Soothing rain shoots grow into saplings. Oh my gosh. The dialogue is so slow.
And now I'm being drenched in light. Hello? Oh, Link! I, too, grow in height under the soothing rain. I would imagine you're a tree. I had another vision just now. I saw a lake shaped like eyeglasses. Uh, gee, I wonder if I'm supposed to go to Eyeglass Lake. So what we're going to do this episode, the rest of this episode at least, is burn the monkey. I mean, pigs? I guess? I honestly don't know. School so No. Woods of Winter? No. Moron Village? Yes. So it won't take much to figure out, but what I'm doing here is I'm actually trying... I was going to trigger that! Uh... Hi! We meet again! You know the drill. Best is what wins. Ready? Go. So for those who don't know, when you trigger that enough, she'll go faster and faster. Eventually, it'll, it'll cause her to hold a heart piece. I want that. I mean, kind of like one of our other episodes. I don't know if it's the same series or not, but kind of like it. I I do kind of. Uh, there's something I need to figure out first. So. I describe this. I had it, then I lost it. Um, the basic idea is you kill enough enemies, she appears. She'll appear over and over again, and eventually, she will have a heart piece. If you pick up the heart piece before she does, you're good. But she aims for the heart piece first, and she is fast at that point. We are going to aim to beat that today. That is our ultimate goal for this episode. I am Vasu, the jewelry. The jeweler. I'm jewelry now. Is this your first time? Then let me explain jewelry. I know what jewelry is, dude. Rings made from mystical seeds have very mystical powers. If you wear one, its mystical power will be passed to you. But you must keep it in your ring box. I remember one episode, I don't know if it was an attempt or not, but I actually attempted to upgrade the ring box without realizing I didn't have a ring box yet. You won't be able to use it. Understood? Yes, I understand. Oh, you don't have a ring box? I like you, so here. Take this ring box. A level one ring box. Now we can upgrade it. One ring. Take this ring as a sign of our friendship. You got a ring. Get it appraised. It's going to be the friendship ring if I remember correctly. Oh my gosh. Hmm. See, I call this the discovery ring. Send soft earth nearby. I'll appraise it. I don't need that. Buy one for 30. Now the list. Praise rings. Okay, so it's a completionist thing. If you want to complete, complete the game. Rings do nothing unless warm. You come in. Okay, blah, 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 blah. What can I do? Praise this. Hmm, I see. I call this the Red Luck Ring. Half damage from spiked floors. Well, that's no fun! Light Light Ring. Become a light... <laughs> that's... <laughs> we'll save that for another episode, but yeah. Add to the list. 
see. I call this the, another like my ring. You have this one already, so I'll buy it for 30 rupees. Thank you, I guess. The Green Joy Ring. Find double or chunks. Friendship ring. This is the one that he gives us. I've appraised all your rings. You do nothing unless worn. So, the ring I was hoping for, we don't have yet. Shoot. And there are a lot of. That's totally useful right now. Sure. I mean, that ring does nothing anyway. That's why I'm wearing it, just because. So the ring I was looking for, actually what it's supposed to do is it's supposed to make it easier to hunt down her, Mabel. I actually forgot her name for a bit. So as of right now, I have to fight 30 enemies to summon her once. Um, this is going to be applied. If I exit the screen and go back, will they be back? No. basic idea, I guess, is, you know, I was going to make it overtime thing, but if it's going to be this much of a plot about it, there we go. Three, six. The idea is I'd have to do that six times. Ah! Found the cheese. Every six times, I believe. Actually, every five times. I can't math right now. Every five times, she'll show up. That should be enough. Ah. That is not kill all. That'll make her burn as well. Ugh. Wow. She's, um, she is very persistent. I thought you only had to kill 30 enemies for this. Oh, that would mean 10 to oops. That means like two more times, I guess. I can't math right now, guys. Get, cut me some slack out. No one likes math in the first place. Still nothing. Wow. Shouldn't be too much longer, though. I would have already done it if I had that ring I was talking about. But, um... The game just didn't want to be nice for some weird reason. Sheesh. Did I get the number wrong 
or something? There it is. I lost track. Huh? You know the drill. Fastest going wins. Ready? a heart piece in the mix at all. Hold on. Keep fighting until she shows up with the heart piece because uh, I don't think she had it that time. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty dang sure she didn't have it. You just dress me, Ruot! Ow. I'm actually counting this time, so that's six. Time for nine. Welcome to counting class, everyone. Okay, nine. Twelve is up next. If you don't know how to count by threes, then this this is one way to learn, I guess. So if this was like the normal path, right here after doing it this time would trigger her, but um, yeah that didn't happen, meaning we have five more times I believe. Still going. I believe that was 18. And yes, this is the whole episode. I know it's not exciting stuff, but you know what? I'll have a gift for us next time. Let's put it that way. For those who are mustering through this episode, don't worry. Fun's to come. Just not this time. This time we're more focused on this. It's random what she drops. Yo. I'm gonna keep loading this until she drops what I want her to drop. Normally you can't do this in this game, by the way. It's just... She 
you guys get the pattern. Basically, it's the same thing over and over and over again. Let's skip ahead to when we actually do get to the point where she has the heart piece in hand. Might be a little bit, but I'll, we'll catch you guys there. Behind my, it's right here. It's right here. Oh gosh, she's gonna go after that first. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. <laughs> we meet again. You know the drill. Fastest one wins. Ready? Go. Ah. I can cheese it though. Unlike back in the day. Today we can cheese that. This should be the same. Yep. Why is it over there? Okay, so for you to get that, I know I'm reloading, and most of the time I wouldn't do this, but for this game, uh, yes, I would. Everything is showing up here, actually. Literally everything. A ring? Gasha seed? Potion? Literally everything is here. Okay, that's, that's bogus. You know, if you're going to put it in the dead opposite side, I'm sitting in the dead center. I'm sitting in the dead center so you can't cheese me. Bad idea. Yes, I know the drill. Ah! Screw you, lady. Well, it's four and all. Meaning... I will too. I'm never doing this again. That should mean I have three. I get saved all of them. Two of four. Wait. Oh, I know what the other one is. Okay, yeah. Nope, this is accurate. Okay. We got two hard pieces left, and luckily the other two are... Very easy to get compared to this bull crap. Whew. If I, I'm looking at the time we're at right now, and uh, that took me 40 minutes to do, at least to activate. So, I know this episode was kind of bland, but I'm definitely leaving it here. Oh no, wait. This wasn't exactly supposed to be a joking, exciting episode. It was just supposed to be a let's get the worst bits of it done. As far as side stuff goes. There is one other thing we can do, but we're not going to do it yet if we do it. That is the trading sequence. But, I don't know, we'll see. To me, 100%ing is literally just getting all the heart pieces and beating the game. Maybe to some other people it's different. I don't know, we'll see. Anyways, I am going to leave this video here. Phew! <laughs> We're done with that. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Legend of Zelda Oracle Seasons. If you liked it, for some strange reason, as dry as it may have been, make sure to push that like button and hit the bell you can't see it anymore. And if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestion for a Zelda game you'd like to see on here? Let us know in the comments below. Want to check out one that's been done prior to this? Click the link in the bottom right corner. Try and take you to that destination. Miss any of the stops on this right? Click the link across my head here and the train take you there. In the meantime, this train's off to its next destination where we hope to catch you guys in another ride. Bye!